So over the past three months, I've got to know a very wonderful young man. Um, he's taught me definitely to take another side, another look at some great activities that um, some of us don't usually look at, and even watching some NASCAR every now and again now. So, <laughs> so our love for movies kind of brought us together, but our shared obsession for Back to the Future, most importantly, Back to the Future 2. Yes, ma'am. <laughs> has now made a bond that will not break ever. So without further ado, David Hunter. Thank you, Amy. Thank you. Good evening. My name is David Hunter. I hope tonight my message will inspire you to look at our lives as a race. In my race, I have to lead on my strengths, confidence, dependability, and presence. Tonight is my chance to tell you how my strengths make me a winner in the race of life. One of my favorite things to do is to get together with my friends and family and watch NASCAR. It was a gathering in high school when I heard Kyle Petty speaking about safe driving that I gained a deep respect for NASCAR. I enjoyed the adrenaline, the camaraderie, and the overall show that is put on. The adrenaline is equal to confidence, the camaraderie to dependability, and the overall show is presence. In a race, a driver needs the media, sponsors, fans, and a pit crew to take care of him. My media are the organizations that have assisted in making my life and activities possible for me. Special Olympics has given me many opportunities and has taught me to be confident in all that I do. My sponsors are my family that are always there for me and have helped me become who I am today. My family has helped me build a strong faith that I am dedicated to. My faith has shown me that I am dependent on to be strong for others. My fans are my friends who are always there to cheer me on, whether they are in the stands cheering or at home cheering from afar. It is my fans that may put on a show full of presence. And finally, my pit crew are my coach, caretakers, roommates, and all others that support me. This crew helps me get through any bump in the road that help me refuel and they keep and they keep me calm and healthy during my race. It is my pit crew that I have to listen closely to in order to keep my strengths tuned. Of course, of, a course of life is created for us long before we even realize there is a race to attend. The course is tailor-made for us, and if we can, and if we can truly follow it, the road will lead to our final win. This is when confidence takes over. When I am confident about my direction, I can drive smoothly and stay on course. But there are times when the distraction of the other courses and drivers may pull you off your track. This is when the sponsors and pit crew kick into high gear and help the driver understand that being off course and maybe even crashing isn't the end of your race and that you can recover. In time, a good driver can depend on can be dependent on to get on to to get back onto course and redeem their place. My pit crew depends on me to race safely and soundly. 
If I don't, they there they are there to help me. An important thing that I have learned is that one of the events in my course is not for me to drive, but for me to step out of my race to take my place in my fellow racers pit crews. They can depend on me to help them. Even if they may never be on even <clears throat> even if they may never be able to serve them on my pit crew. Then I jump back into my car and burn rubber. <laughs> That's the presence in me. I try to be an example to all other racers. I strive to present myself proudly to all my fans and to each other to teach the message that we are not racing against each other, but with each other. When we respect ourselves and help each other, nothing is impossible to achieve in the race of life.